So what do you do after you fillet a fish? A lot of people just throw it away. But I'll show you an alternative. Okay, so anyways, throw the body bones away, keep the fish heads, degill them, and we're going to make steamed fish heads today. Uh, we have three stripers and a white bass, or some people know them as a sand bass. So, let's get going. Alright, let's take a look at the steamer that I'm going to be using. It is a very average steamer, you can say. All Asian families usually have one of these. And water, not boiling yet. And then on top, the steam will come through these holes once it's hot enough. And then you'll need to find a plastic Tupperware that could withstand the heat, and you should be okay. Awesome. Alright, then what you want to do is put all the fish heads, uh, stack them as tightly as you can into your bowl. I stacked four fish heads and they all fit. Uh, do one medium sized tomato, uh, just dice it up I guess, or just chop it up into eights or ten slices, put them on top. Uh, five cloves of garlic, I'm a garlic person, you can go three. And of course, uh, some lemongrass. We got black pepper, scallions, cilantro, tomatoes, ginger, lemongrass, oyster sauce, salt, pepper, basil, anything you want on your steamed fish. And here it is. Here's a fish on the inside. And you do want to stack it like that. The water vapor will condense and it will create water. And when the water builds it'll probably end up being about right there when it's all cooked it takes about 30 minutes in the steamer once the steamer is fully uh... going i guess there you go alright it's almost ready to go if you'd like anything else in your fish throw it in uh... this is supposed to be a spicy dish but one of the family members has requested uh... not to put chili peppers in it for tonight so we're not going to do that tonight, but usually I like to throw three or four, maybe even five chili, Thai pepper chilies on top, and mmm, so good. Oh, can you hear that? The from the steam. Let's take a look. Oh yeah. There it is. You can smell it. Put it back. Not ready yet. Okay, um, it's been steaming for 45 minutes. I just took it out. And the way you can tell if it's done is if you poke the skin and it just breaks. There's no resistance in the skin. And as you can see, there's a lot of liquid. A lot of liquid. And here's the fish.